Hi, welcome to interview.com. I'm going to explain to you one of the important Java entry question. What is JVM? What is Java Virtual Machine? JVM stands for Java Virtual Machine. It's an abstract computer or virtual computer which runs the compiled Java program. For example, employee.class. Actually, JVM is a software implementation which stands on top of real hardware and operating system. It provides abstraction between the compiled Java program and the hardware and the operating system. Okay. Before going to the next statement, I just want to tell you simple in simple sentence, why do you need a Java virtual machine? See, whenever you write a employee.java file, okay? So if you want to run this employee.java file in both Windows and Linux machine, you have to compile only once. You will get employee.class file. So place this employee.class file in Linux machine as well as in Windows machine. Okay, so you might ask how the how the employee.class file will talk to the Linux OS. How the uh, employee.class file will talk to Windows OS. That's where the JVM comes into picture. So between the class file, so between the class between the hardware the, between the operating system between the operating system okay and the class file there is the there comes jre or jvm okay this is the this is where the major role plays so there will be different jvm for different operating system so the advantage here is you have to compile you have to write the code once and compile once that's all you can place it any operating system mac or windows or linux or whatever it is so this is the only advantage of using virtual java virtual machine so the compile program does not have to worry about what hardware and operating system he has to run because it is taken care by the jvm java virtual machine it knows how to call the um, os apis it's it is all handled by jvm and thus attaining portability all java programs are compiled to byte codes very very important both byte codes portability hardware and operating system jvm can only understand and execute java byte codes you can visualize java byte codes as machine language for jvm okay java compiler takes a java files dot java files and compiles it to a byte code file with a class dot file extension compiler generates one class file for one source this might be look very basic but most of the developers were not clear why do I need a JVM at all okay so it, it is a good question to to know okay so here I've told you the advantage the only advantage here is you don't have to worry about how will it run in the different operating system okay you your worry is to write the Java code and compile it you give the class file to Linux uh, mac os mobile windows whatever it is so the jvm there are different jvm there are different jvms will which will be running in the different os so different jvm for different os okay different jvm for different os that's where the problem is solved okay hope this interview question is useful for your interview preparation if you are looking for a job opportunity please submit your resume in our job portal this is the link for uh, in our job portal you can submit your resume we will do the needful for you to find the right job uh, based on your skill set okay for more java entry questions entry tips resume building tips career tips please log on to nt.com and there are a lot of videos in our job portal you can watch them and it will be really useful for your entry preparation you can log on to nt.com it is next generation job site thank you for watching this video and all the best for interview thank you